I can assure you that this video is going to be very important for those who are looking for direct jobs in Europe and wish to move and work here in coming months. In case, if you never thought about moving and growing your career in Denmark, then I highly recommend you to consider it. I have talked enough about Germany as I have been living here since many years now but I am always curious about job market lifestyle of different countries here in Europe. This time, I did a thorough research, I asked few of my connections in Denmark, I analyzed job market and I also studied recent initiative by Danish government regarding visa simplification for people who wish to migrate from India or any non-European country. So this video is going to be very quick, to the point and informative. You will get the list of companies which are sponsoring visa or hiring people from foreign countries. Let's first take a look at Denmark's latest visa simplification and understand how much it is easy to move to Denmark not only for software developers but also for people from other backgrounds. Hello and welcome back to my channel. My name is Arshad and I share information about jobs in Europe, how to crack your job interview. Furthermore, I have helped hundreds of people to achieve their dream of moving abroad. So based on recent sessions in Parliament of Denmark, all parties collectively voted to simplify visa complications for immigrants who wants to work in Denmark. Which means now it is relatively easier for companies in Denmark to hire people from non-European countries like India, Pakistan, Bangladesh, Middle East or any Asian countries. But I've seen many comments from you guys that I always talk about high skill workers like engineers and software developers. I mean, I try to cover job opportunities for other fields as well, but since European countries are more more focusing on high skilled workers and it is relatively easy for those frames. But don't worry, today I will talk about non high skilled worker category as well, meaning those who do not fall under the category of engineer, researchers, data scientists, data engineer, mathematicians, so on and so forth. So stick to the video till the end. There is this visa offered by a Danish government called Pay Limit Scheme, which is a way for non-European citizen to get a work permit in Denmark. To qualify for the scheme, you need to have a job offer that pays salary of at least 4,8,800 Danish Kron, which is approximately 64,000 US dollar per year. But recently, this minimum salary amount has been reduced to 3,75,000 Danish Kron, which is around 55,000 US dollar per year approximately. According to Wolfson, who is a country manager of EY's Global Immigration Practice in Denmark, he said that the reduced salary threshold could have a significant impact on a smaller company that hire people in industries with lower salary threshold, especially those with limited work experience. Best thing about this visa is that unlike other type of work permits, applicants do not need a specific educational background and the job does not need to be within the specific professional field. But there is a twist. For employers, it is important to fulfill certain requirements regarding job advertising. Specifically, the job must be advertised on the Danish portal, which are these two, and the ad should be there for minimum of two weeks prior to the application. To verify the declaration made by the employer, the Danish agency for international recruitment and integration, Siri, carries out spot checks during the application process. But that's all about employers, you do not need to worry about anything here. But what you need to understand is all those visa sponsored jobs in Denmark will be there on those two portals. So you can go and check jobs on these websites as well. I'll put the links in the description box. Alright, I will not spend any more time talking about visa now. But if you want me to create a dedicated video explaining about this visa, then please write down in the comment box. Now you understood how this visa process works and where to look for a job. Let me give you some companies in Denmark which are actively hiring these days. But before that, if you haven't checked this website, then I recommend you to please go and check settle-germany.com. Here you will find my own resume templates, my cover letter, a solid, accurate and precisely drafted guides that can help you to settle abroad. Furthermore, I am also providing one-on-one -on -one dedicated sessions just in case if you want to speak with me and if you want personalized suggestion, guidance or consulting from me. Obviously, they are paired with the minimal charges if I compare the values that you will get out of those sessions. As you can see, until now, I have conducted more than 100 sessions from the last month and many of them have already received the job offer. I will also include the video testimonial page so that you can validate that. Do not hesitate to go and check out the website, book your session, talk with me, we can make a proper plan for you if you really wish to move abroad. In case if you are struggling financially and cannot afford to pay at this moment, then you can also drop me an email on info at the settled-germany.com. First company in list is Novo Nordisk. Novo Nordisk is world's leader in diabetic care and already employ more than 42,000 employees in 77 countries. They have more than 500 open positions in different different sectors. You can find jobs on LinkedIn as well as on their career website. Second company in the list is Drip. Drip is an e-commerce marketing automation platform that has generated more than 
2 billion revenue for their customers since 2018 i found some opportunities in business development and management sectors they also have openings in sales product as well as engineering department check this link i'll also attach the link in the description if you are into hr and administration then check this company called black beer they are looking for hr staff if you are into marketing or business development then you can check acti it's a small startup company and they are creating a digital learning concepts that supports organizational development next company on my list is grundfoss a water technology company that produces pump systems and control for water supply and wastewater treatment there are more than 50 job postings on linkedin for denmark location and overall there are more than 400 job openings europe wide next company is terp and corporation they are state of the art provider of total retail solutions in europe they are locally represented in denmark sweden norway and germany i can see some opportunities on their career portal in the management sector another company that i would like to mention is lego group the lego group is a famous danish toy company known for its colorful building blocks and imaginative play sets they are hiring a lot within the engineering sector such as software developer or lead engineers there are many other companies who have started expanding their skill hunt across the borders and due to recent visa changes and relaxation on hiring foreign workers you should be prepared and keep an eye on these companies in the end it is all about hitting at the right moment and seizing the right opportunity at the right time you should also take a look into the companies like keolis denmark kolux immersion base life science hey inspectly coftrus vestas mias group wunderman thompson map rockwood group etc these are the companies where you will find a lot of job openings and some of them are also very supportive when it comes to working remotely here is my instagram handle where i try to post job opportunities available on the internet as well as i share information related to settling abroad and immigration updates make sure you follow but as i promised i will also talk about those who do not fall under the category of high skill workers if you are non high skill worker there are still several ways to move to denmark in 2023 I have five options for you. First, working holiday visa. If you are between 18 to 30 years old and a citizen of Australia, Canada, Chile, Japan, New Zealand or South Korea, you can apply for a working holiday visa to Denmark. This visa allows you to live and work in Denmark. However, the number of working holiday visas is limited so you should apply as early as possible second option would be study in denmark if you are a non european citizen and if you want to study in denmark you can apply for a student visa this visa allows you to live and study in denmark for the duration of the course after you finish your studies you can apply for a work permit if you have a job offer that meets the salary requirement third option is family reunification if you have a member who is a danish citizen or has a valid residence permit in denmark you can apply for a family reunification visa it's like a dependent visa in germany this visa allows you to live and work in denmark while you are reunited with your family member now the fourth option is start a business if you have a good business idea you can apply for a startup visa this visa allows you to start and run a business in denmark for up to 2 years to qualify for a startup visa you need to have a business plan and a support of a danish business incubator fifth option is job seekers visa if you want to search for a job in denmark you can apply for job seekers visa this visa allows you to live in denmark for up to 6 month while you search for the job again it is similar like a germany's job seekers visa if you find a job that meets the salary requirement you can apply for a work permit or you can convert your job seekers visa into the long term work permit in summary there are several ways for non high skill workers to move to denmark in 2023 this includes applying for a working holiday visa studying in denmark family reunification starting a business or applying for a job seekers visa i have created five more videos which talks about job opportunities in different european countries i have also talked about some tips and hacks that you can try to get jobs in europe i will be releasing those videos every week so make sure you subscribe to this channel make sure you check my website and make sure you join my facebook group community i'll see you in the next one meanwhile take care stay healthy and stay wealthy